Clara Estelle Breed was a teenager when her family moved to San Diego in 1920. By 1927, she had finished high school and received her MA in Library Sciences. The next year, she was hired by the City of San Diego as a children's librarian. Miss Breed continued to work in and contribute to the San Diego Public Library for over 40 years. Clara's efforts to share the wonderful world of books included the establishment of the Sarah Cooperative Library System. This allowed cardholders to check out books anywhere in San Diego or Imperial Counties and is still in use today. She was also instrumental in the establishment of several new San Diego libraries during her career. Miss Breed is most famous, though, for her efforts during the time of World War II and the Japanese-American internment camps. As a librarian, Clara was a friend to all children, and when the Japanese-American children who frequented her branch were incarcerated, Miss Breed took action. In open opposition to the racial prejudice of the Japanese Exclusion Act, Miss Breed wrote letters and articles decrying the injustice of the movement. To the children, Miss Breed gave stamp postcards asking them to write. It was the opening line of these many letters, Dear Miss Breed, that became the beloved moniker used as the title for Joanne Oppenheim's biography and for exhibits at the San Diego Central Library and the Japanese American National Museum. Clara didn't stop at letters, however. She also sent many books to help the children through this difficult time. At one point, Miss Breed traveled to camps in Arizona to visit with some of the children and wrote letters for family members who had been separated. Clara Estelle Breed was a devoted librarian and humanitarian. During a time of great suffering for Japanese Americans, Miss Breed remained a lifeline of information, compassion, and hope for numerous children and their families. It is this dedication to the nurturing of all children and her opposition to racial bias that compel us to honor Miss Breed today.